Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who haven't been here before, my name is Lori Hill and I make videos about plastic surgery. My goal is to show you that beauty is attainable. It's also to lift the secrecy that surrounds plastic surgery because everyone deserves to feel beautiful. If that sounds good to you, please subscribe. When I make these celebrity plastic surgery videos, it's never to expose that celebrity. It's simply to show you that the perfection of the entertainment industry is not real. Please don't send any hate to that celebrity. Leave your comments, good and bad, here in my comment box below. Today we're gonna do a mini episode about Paris Hilton. You guys requested Paris over and over, and I finally had a chance to do this beautiful woman. We are only discussing Paris's face on YouTube, but if you'd like to know about Paris's possible body plastic surgery, please go visit my Patreon, as I'm only able to discuss celebrity bodies on there. My Patreon link is down below. The plastic surgery analysis in this video is always my opinion only and is not based on medical facts of that patient. Paris Hilton is a 39-year-old American media personality, businesswoman, socialite, model, actress, and DJ. She is the great-granddaughter of Conrad Hilton, the founder of Hilton Hotels. Recently, Paris also became a documentary filmmaker, exposing the danger of reformatory schools. Paris was always a very pretty girl. She has a beautiful jaw and balanced facial features. She also bears a striking resemblance to her mom. Here is Paris in her high school photos. One very noticeable feature Paris has in her early days that she doesn't have a few years later is her low crease on her upper eyelids. I do think that she had her excess upper eyelid skin removed and this created higher eyelid creases and more makeup space. Here is the way we're used to seeing Paris's eyes look with a bit more hollowed out upper eyelid. Years later, we see that one of Paris's eyes has developed a droop. This may be due to brow compensation or some other side effect from eyelid surgery. Nevertheless, we see that a few years later, that droop has been repaired and is no longer an issue. The next notable feature Paris had altered was her nose. We see her original nose right here. Although it was symmetrical, it did have a bulbous tip and bridge. In the after photos, we see that her nose has become significantly thinner. The tip and bridge have been made a lot smaller. Upon further research, I found that Paris had at least two nose jobs to bring her to the nose that she has today. What I love about her nose job was they kept the downward tilt of her nose and didn't attempt to change it to an upturned nose. She still looks like herself, only a refined version that really puts the focus on her gorgeous eye shape. Speaking of her eyes, Paris's original eye color is a hazel green, but she's well known to wear color contacts that make them a more intense blue. Over the years, I do believe that Paris uses some Botox and also some dermal and lip fillers as yearly maintenance for her looks. So I did watch the new Paris Hilton documentary, This is Paris, and I was shocked how young and beautiful Paris looked. She is currently 39 years old and has the skin of someone in their 20s. I happened to watch the documentary on my television and I did notice that her skin appeared to be filtered. I'm not saying that her skin isn't nice, but I am saying that it's not like the perfect flawless skin you see on the documentary. So I did want to mention this just in case you're comparing your skin to hers. As you can see in these photos, she has neck creases, fine lines, just like all of us, which makes her human. Paris says that she likes to get oxygen facials, microdermabrasion, and 24 karat gold masks. Oxygen facials are said to strengthen your skin's elasticity and help eliminate acne-causing bacteria, as well as reduce fine lines and wrinkles 
and even out skin tones. Now, in regards to microdermabrasion, I've actually had this treatment and I really loved it because it made my skin feel really smooth. Microdermabrasion is a mildly abrasive treatment and it basically just sands down your skin. It removes an uneven outer layer. It's also used to treat some light scarring and discoloration and sun damage and even stretch marks. So regarding the 24 gold carat mask, I did look it up on the Sephora website and they do sell one for $85. It promises to lift and firm the appearance of skin while imparting an opulent glow. I'm so tempted to buy it just to see if it works. Now Paris herself has her own skincare line that's called Pro DNA. And while I do think that skincare is really important, I think that Paris lucked out with her genetics. Paris is really fair and fair skin is super hard to take care of as I myself know very well. But Paris has made it a point to stay out of the sun and always to use an SPF. Another thing she has going for her is her strong bone structure. Because of her bone structure, it acts as a scaffolding, holding her face into place. While someone with a more weak bone structure may see their face starting to droop earlier on in life. Another aspect of Paris looking youthful is that she stayed about the same weight all her life. She's always been pretty thin and she stuck close to her body weight. When there's less fat in the face, there's less fat to sag the face. I do think that Paris has had skin treatments like lasers. One great thing about having pale skin is that you can use just about any laser out there. And to me, her skin does seem like it's been lasered. Paris has denied having any plastic surgery. She says, I've never done any Botox, fillers, no plastic surgery in my life. How much does it cost to have a look like Paris Hilton? Nose job, 15,000. Second nose job, 15,000. Upper blepharoplasty, 10,000. Lip fillers, 5,000. Dermal fillers, 5,000. Botox, 5,000. CO2 laser treatments, 10,000. Total beauty investment, $65,000. Let me know your favorite skincare products in the comments below. You can also let me know what you think of Paris' transformation. Thank you guys so much for watching. Coming up next is my Kim Kardashian video or binge watch my celebrity playlist. Bye. Bye. <laughs>